Hey guys, it is Friday and it's time for Friday Faves. Friday Faves. Yay! Alright, but before we get started into Friday Faves, I want to show y'all some things that I actually finished up that I was using in this week's makeup tutorial. Um, makeup week and some stuff that I did pan this week when I was doing my video as well. I did finish off this concealer that I did picked in my makeup thing. This is the Sheer Cover Concealer. It is in the shade Light Medium and I did finish it off. There's maybe a little in the corner but I'm not going to worry about that. So I did finish that off. This is um, empty, um, gotta put it back in shop my stash so I can show it off when I do shop my stash and talk about it. No, show it, well, show it off to talk about it. There's a fly in here bugging me and there's been a mosquito in here bugging me and my face looks bright with light. I've been using the little LA Color Palette. Isn't it gorgeous? As you can see from the lights, I just pan that shade. Yes, I did. Have it panned. And now it's even a bigger pan. So, I notice how you can tell when people wear a palette and they like it so much. They actually pan a shade in it. I was like, wow. It's like exciting for me because it is like the bomb. Diggity, 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 bomb. So also, this is my Juvia's Place palette. Y'all all know how much I love this palette. This is going to be one of the palettes in my Friday faves. Yes. But I pinned a shade in my Juvia's Place palette. A shocking, right? Never thought I'd hit pan in a Juvia's Place palette because I love them so much. But they're so gorgeous, so beautiful. Juvia's Place, I love your palettes, girl. Keep up the good work. Another one in my Friday faves is the BYS Blush Palette. Now, I'm not for sure if you still get this palette at all, but I did finish this shade off, and now I'm on this shade trying to finish it up because I panned it. I think it was not yesterday, but the day before yesterday, I panned this, and I didn't want to talk about me panning it until Friday faves because I knew this was going to be one of my Friday fave videos. I love this palette. I have to check my my family dollar store and see if they have this palette again. I'd be able to get. I don't like. Hmm. I don't like the smell of the product, but I love the product itself. Also, I've been loving the Urban Decay Perversion Mascara. It's one of my favorite high-end mascaras of all times besides the two base better than sex and they're real by benefits those are some of my favorite high-end mascaras I don't have very much high-end makeup but when I do save up money to buy a piece of high-end makeup I try by watching declutter videos and makeup collection videos to see if there is something you know that a lot of people on there are talking about when they do their makeup and I like to watch a lot of shop my stashes videos because I see what a lot of people have been trying out. So that lets me know what to write down on paper and try out. Another one of my Friday faves is by First Aid Beauty is the Hello Fab. I have been loving this. I've been using it at all. I've been using it all the whole time this week for face primer. It is awesome. It's in three in one super fruity. It is a correcting caution for a correcting a, to do correcting on your makeup, but I've been using it as a face primer and it works wonderful as a face primer on my face. It holds my makeup on all day. My face is silky and soft with it on. My face right now, if you were to feel my face, it feels like a baby's bottom. That is how wonderful this feels on my face with all my makeup. Everything stays on my face all day long with this, and I love it so much. Going into another one of my Friday faves, 
This is a little L'Oreal um, palette. It's I don't have my glasses to read the shade, but it's like a little tan shade. And I use this as an eyeshadow primer. Let me get my glasses real quick. So I can tell you what this shade of this is. This is in Mix and 302 Mix and Mate. And I definitely love this shade. It's a very, very pretty shade, and I do love this shade, and I use it as a primer, not a primer, but before I put on my eyeshadow primer, I put this on, and then my eyeshadow primer works wonders. It keeps my mas mascara, yeah, it keeps my mascara on, it keeps my eyeshadow on all day long. Another one of my faves is this one here. This is... L'Oreal in Blazing Lava. I'm loving this lipstick. I love the L'Oreal lipsticks now. Again, I used to love them a lot. And I quit liking them. And then I started liking them again. And that is a beautiful shade. I love the shimmers in it. When I first tried it out, it felt gritty on my lips. But now I don't. It was okay. And I do love Love, love that lipstick. Another lipstick that I've been lo loving. This is the little mini size of the lipstick queen. I do have it on my lips today. I actually picked it. It's a green shade, but there's a problem with this lipstick. It is pretty. It's kind of clear. It says green, but clear, and it says colors once you get going. I think it's like a mood lipstick or something. But today I found out broke and I was very disappointed that it broke but like I told myself that's okay I'm gonna use it up it will get used up and then I want to keep the little container because cinnamon white this means a lot to me I saved up my money to buy me that lip balm that lipstick queen lipstick I saved my money to get it then this was given to me by a friend on YouTube it's sinful colors it is in the shade Ridiculous. And I know you can get these at Dollar Tree. I haven't really seen them at my Dollar Tree, but um, she had gets them from her Dollar Tree. And it is a gorgeous, it looks green, but really it's not. Kind of, it's like a blue green shade. See that clear shade is changing colors. It's like a blue green shade, and I love the shade. I wore the shade the other day on my lips, and people were telling me it didn't look good on my lips. But what do they know? They don't have to wear it. I do. It's up to me, not them. Another one of my faves. Another one of my faves is this nice place. I've talked about these before in my Friday faves. My video is going to be long. I'm sorry. But I do love these. And you can get these off of Wish. And you can also get these off of Amazon. I got this in a swamp box. A small set in swamp box. From a friend. That I did a swamp with. And I love it so much. Thank you Stephanie. And another one of my Friday babes. I just had a video on this. On Instagram. And on here. And this is the Anastasia eyeshadow primer. I love it so much, but like I did say, the only flaw was it drips. And when you squeeze a little out, a little bit too much comes out. But I do love that product as well. And my last but least favorite product is number five. It's in the shade 15, which is light. And that is the Maybelline Fit Me Powder. I've been talking about this. Maybelline, if you're watching this video, you did an awesome job when you made this powder. If you can tell, I'm almost out of it. I'm constantly using it. I'm sorry. But it is definitely, definitely one of my fave, fave favorites. Thank you, guys. I love y'all. And I want to thank y'all for watching this video. This is my Friday Babes. Give it a video a thumbs up if you like Friday Babes. And give it a thumbs up. Until next time, guys. I love you and hope you have a wonderful, blessed day. Until next time. Bye, guys.